wondering, while it may seem like Amazon and other online retailers are taking over new uh, some new data from our NBC News Wall Street Journal po poll shows that the online revolution may not be everyone's favorite, at least not yet. American consumers are hungry for change, but also hankering for shopping the old-fashioned way. American consumers have a long-standing love affair with shopping and with technology, but when they're combined, the reviews are mixed. According to the new NBC News Wall Street Journal Social Trends poll, on the road, ride-sharing is a hit. A majority of Americans say services like Lyft and Uber are good for the country. And 42% of Americans say sharing a home through Airbnb instead of booking a hotel is good, too. But Americans are far less confident when it comes to going online for the things you might want to touch and feel at the store. That Amazon effect may not be as pervasive as you think. When it comes to buying groceries online through delivery services like Amazon and Fresh Direct, half of all Americans are not sold on the idea and a quarter think it's just no good at all. I want to see what I'm buying. You know, I don't want to like trust that whomever picks out my avocados for me knows how to do it. As for shopping online instead of at the mall, Americans are divided too. 22% think online shopping is good for the country, but 25% think it isn't. I'm part of the problem because I do use Amazon. Um, on the other hand, I hate seeing little stores close down. At the same time, almost no one is happy that large chains like Walmart and Target have taken over local mom and pop stores. You're going to come in here and get customer service that you're not going to get in either of those places. Renee Kennedy is the owner of Earth Baby, an independent baby product retailer in Los Angeles. We know your name when you walk in. You know our name. I know about your family. You know about my family. My family owns a retail shoe business, and that's currently going out at the moment. Um, where my parents are looking for other jobs just because the um, local businesses are kind of dying off. The bottom line, consumers want variety, but not at the expense of their communities or less competition. And then if you want some ideas, let me know and I can chime in. Okay, perfect, thank you. So smaller businesses are tapping into so a renewed demand for that personal box? touch. Um, as we head into this retail season, we'll be watching how all of these trends play out. Right now, Amazon does dominate about 75% of online retail, but Google and Walmart are also playing to win over your wallet as well, guys. Interesting results there, Joe. Thank you. I like polar opposites on this one. Yeah. You buy just about everything online. Everything. everything. Except for, I don't want why someone to pick why my don't avocado. You buy either. Either. I, I, what she said, I like to touch, touch it, touch feel it. it. I want to see it in person. Yeah. Mm. Touch it, feel it, send yes. it back. There you go. <laughs> Hello, today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Channel, subscribe by clicking that button down there and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.